Live from the KATC TV3 studios, this is Acadiana's News Channel at 10. Good evening and thanks for choosing Acadiana's News Channel at 10. I'm Taylor Toole. It's election night in Acadiana and voters in four parishes headed to the polls to cast their ballots on several races from school board seats to bond issues. Tonight we're watching the race for mayor in Generet closely and voters there deciding between the incumbent Carol Bourgeois and Clarence Clark. Here's a look at what the Secretary of State is reporting. Carol Bourgeois has won re-election with 55% of the vote. Our Christina Mondragon has spent her day in Generet. She's standing by at the re-elected mayor's watch party. Christina. Hi Taylor. As you can see behind me, everyone's in super positive mood after Mayor Boudreau has won the re-election for mayor. Now, Mayor Boudreau, tell me what it feels like to be re-elected as mayor. Well, it gives me the uh, feeling of knowing that my community had the confidence in me to continue the job that we started in going forward. Certainly uh, appreciate it all and give them all glory to God for it. That's amazing, Mayor. And again, why do you think the community voted for you to be re-elected as mayor of Generet? Well, I think I've presented a positive uh, image in the servant leadership that I've given the community over the last four years and certainly the abilities to continue networking and putting together the programs that we're going to need in going forward. Uh, my motto was let's continue to revive and uh, generate for its uh, presence and its future. Amazing and now that you have four more years what's the first item on your agenda for well, the first, citizens? First item is actually to put together a, a extensive or comprehensive master plan going forward for the development of Generate in all areas, especially economic development and addressing a lot of our infrastructure issues. Yes, sir. Well, thank you so much and congratulations. And guys, what do you feel about the re-election? Four more years?